Joel Hickerson, Grindog.com. Today we're going to learn how to draw animals on totem poles. First thing, totem animals would be very strong and very bold, exaggerated uh, elements, like their eyes especially would be carved out of wood, but they'd be carved in such a way that they were actually kind of kind of cartoony almost, um, the way they, they carved them. They do it, and a lot of times the one on the top would have wings that came out. And they would uh, delineate the feathers uh, very strongly. They were very um, conscious of uh, the elements of these birds. Now, the eagle actually um, was on a lot of the totems, and it, it was more of a symbol of strength and leadership. So we could start with an eagle on the top. And they, these totem poles were segmented into the different animals. And maybe the second one would be more round, and that would be a bear, which usually uh, could represent anything from creativity or determination to uh, motherhood, actually, of all things. So... The bear might be the second element we bring down. And what I'm doing is I'm creating these uh, figures with a pencil. But mainly when you draw totem animals, the main thing would be is to have very bold shapes. And uh, to do that, you can come back with your pen and do the outlines. of your totem animals. Okay. Construction lines that I've drawn in pencil are usually more for a guide than anything else. So as I come back to draw the animals, I may uh, redraw the lines entirety in some cases. It gives me a good guide and a good uh, sense of space. This is our bear. Remember, bold are the lines are better. These guys were very graphic, very exaggerated lines. And that's how you draw animals on totem poles.